There is glitter on my face, there is glitter in my hair, there is glitter on my lips, and there is glitter in my heart. Let's get into this video. <laughs> excited about today's video so as you must have guessed from the title we are going to DIY or try to DIY CRT London's latest hit that the internet has been flipping over the glitter flip lipsticks it is a lip product that you apply on your lips it's supposed to go on matte and when you purse your lips together it's supposed to magically transform itself into this like glittery crazy beautifulness i did get a chance to try one at the gen beauty they had not released the products yet so i couldn't purchase them and recently they did get released in sephora and people have been putting videos after videos people have been going gaga if you ask me my personal opinion is it's more of a party trick because the lipstick that i tried at gen beauty it did not last very long it did feel a little bit gritty on my lips and it was gone, you know, by the time I got to the next booth. So I'm not up for dropping $20 on one lipstick that kind of only works as a party trick. I thought, why don't I try and DIY this product? And if it works, not just that it would be cheaper, like way cheaper, but we can actually come up with our own kind of concoctions of colors and then mixes of different colors with different glitters so that we can kind of customize it to ourselves. So I have been trying to kind of come up with a few lipsticks that work because a lot of them didn't work. And the conclusion that I have drawn from is that the lipstick needs to be able to dry matte. Lip glosses and lipsticks that don't dry don't work that well. Lipsticks that are kind of sheer, like I love the Wet n Wild Catsuit lipsticks, but they actually apply in a very thin coat over your lips. Those did not work for me. The lipsticks that were drying super dry did not work for me, like the Kaylin Cosmetics lipstick that I got in my Ipsy bag. And basically very, very light lipsticks didn't give me the contrast, the impact I was looking for. Though I'm thinking that maybe I will try, you know, mixing a light colored lipstick with a dark color glitter and see if that works today. If you know there is a particular formula that, you know, applies patchy or goes on sheer, that would not work either because the lipstick formula needs to be initially, you know, hide most of the glitter that eventually would be revealed. I have a few combinations that I think have worked and I think what would be more fun is if you kind of do this along with me, any glitter that you might have with you and any of your matte lipsticks, give it a try. Just snap a picture and share on Instagram, tag me in it, hashtag pals lives life and I'll be able to find you guys. I'm really looking forward to see how it works for you. All right, let's go supplies you're gonna need lipsticks preferably in darker shades that dry matte on you and have kind of a moussey thick ish texture some glitter so today I'm going to use both craft as well as cosmetic glitter something to mix your product in. I'm pretty much using kind of a cover of a product and I'm just gonna mix it in this plastic container because later on I can throw it out and you're gonna need something to mix and apply your lipstick with. I'm using one of these disposable, you know, lipstick wands that you can purchase in a dollar store or you can just grab from either Sephora or Ulta. So I'm using one of those. I'm using craft glitter only because I have a very limited number of cosmetic shimmers and I don't have some of the colors that I wanted, but I wouldn't recommend using craft glitter for like, you know, actual purposes, you know, you can, test out you know which colors mixed together work better and then if you want to actually wear the lipstick for a long time i would recommend going and buying the glitter that you want the next glitters are not very expensive they you know pretty much retail for like five or six dollars and you you know you can always use the ultras buy one get one half off sale i have also tried using the shimmering loose powder eyeshadow from la colors and they did work sometimes and sometimes it didn't it doesn't have the flip effect that much it makes the lipstick really nice and 
shiny or metallic, but it doesn't make that glitter flip thing. So this is what you're gonna do. You're gonna take your shimmer in your container, swipe some of your lipstick to the sides. Take the amount of lipstick that you usually apply on your lips. For example, if you need to dip back into your lipstick when you are just using the lipstick alone, then take that amount and you're just gonna mix the two together. Make sure that your lipstick kind of is opaque-ish and then apply. Make sure not to smack your lips together because if you do, it doesn't work or at least the Seattle London lipsticks don't work. I feel like my lipstick is a little bit on the lower side. So I'm gonna grab a little bit more of the lipstick. This is a combination of NYX lip lingerie in seduction and some pink craft glitter. And then we are going to wait for the lipstick to pretty much dry completely. Ciate London recommends waiting for a minute. So I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, I have scooted you guys in. This is what the lipstick looks like right now. I can see a little bit of the glitter and I could see that in Ciate's lipsticks as well. So let's try smacking a lips together. Not smacking, it's not. You know, let's try pursing the lips together. Yep, can you see that? Now the glitter is way more apparent. Revolutions Regal and three of NYX cosmetic glitters crystal bronze and gold I wasn't planning on adding crystal but I did it by accident so it's in there all right ready this is how it looks now it does look a little bit you know glittery it doesn't look completely now at it is a little bit glittery it's not as impactful so let's try the next combo this is NYX lip lingerie in French made and NYX glitter in crystal looks shimmery it doesn't look matte from far it did look like matte to me in the viewfinder but um Let's see if there is a big transformation. Okay, ready? Let's go. This worked beautifully. Can you see that? I love this NYX glitter. What do you guys think? I love how kind of like this cool mauve reflects the glitter so well. This glitter is like, I'm staying, I'm not going anywhere. This is the combination of NYX lip lingerie in exotic and three NYX glitters, bronze, copper, and gold. This is what it looks like right now. I can see it kind of having this muted glitter in it and we are going to ignore the glitter that's on the rest of my face it's from the previous applications all right let's go Now we are getting into the dark colors. This is NYX's liquid suede in foul mouth, 
mixed with some purple craft glitter and a just a touch of NYX crystal glitter. This one is really opaque, so I'm hoping it has, you know, the biggest reveal kind of a feel. Let's go. This required a few additional turns of lip smacking. I feel like the purple glitter is not doing it justice, so I'm gonna try this one more time with just the crystal glitter. So this is NYX Liquid Suede in Foul Mouth, some pink craft glitter and some NYX crystal glitter. And I did increase the quantity of glitter that I added to this lipstick as well. So this is how it looks now. Yes, my lipstick application has gotten sloppy as we are progressing into more and more lipsticks. That worked. So I've used the pink glitter, I think, you know, kind of light blue glitter will work very nicely with this color as well. This is NYX Cosmic Metal in Dark Nebula, mixed with some NYX Bronze Glitter and whatever little specks that were still in the pan. The Dark Nebula has kind of, you know, shimmer of its own and that is hiding the glitter really well. It works. It's not super impactful though, like the other matte matte lipsticks, but it works. And it looks pretty. The outcome is pretty. This is NYX Cosmic Metal in Elite mixed with Blue Craft Glitter. I think my lip wand still had the nebula on it and it's mixed in and changed the color of Elite. It has made it this like mauve color. Let's see if it flips. This is Rimmel London's Stay Matte Liquid Lipstick in Pitch Black with some dark and light blue craft glitter. I see, you know, that the shimmer is kind of peeking through because this formula isn't very, very opaque, but this is the only black lipstick I have. It's beautiful, like it did flip. I hope you guys enjoyed this DIY. I still believe this is very gimmicky and very party trick like, but it's so much fun. I think I had more fun creating these myself than if I would have just bought these. I hope you guys give it a try yourself and please, please, please share your creations with me. Tag me in it, hashtag pals lives life so I can find them. I have some other crazy fun ideas in my head that I want to DIY. So please stay tuned for those and hit the notification bell so that you are alerted whenever I upload new videos. And thanks again for watching. Bye.